Uh, Ms. Fulton, you uh, had an extraordinary career. The first uh, class of women at West Point, which was uh, very challenging. Uh, not only did you survive an experience that most people, and I have some experience in this regard, could not have done. Uh, and then you went on uh, in throughout your uh, public service and currently in, in the state of New Jersey, working with people from all different persuasions, uh, the, uh, political, theological, uh, eth ethnic differences, uh, and there's been no complaints by any of your subordinates or any of your superiors about your work. Is that fair? Yes, Senator, that's true. So that the performance of your duties, you've done it in a way that is uh, based on uh, the principles of, I, um, I will be uh, tr somewhat trite, of duty on a country, that you have a job to do and you must do that job. And it's uh, other factors which you might privately, as we all have private sort of thoughts and ideas, do not influence your professional activities. Is that fair? Yes, Senator. I strive to live up to the ideals of duty, honor, country. I do think about that. I'm passionate. I'm strong-willed. I'm a fighter. If I'm a, if I'm confirmed, I will strive to prove to you and every member of this committee every day that I am the person of my record. Well, I, you know, I think obviously the record bears that out in the sense that everyone is entitled to uh, their opinions, um, but they have to recognize their opinions uh, and deal in the workplace with facts and with the principles of fairness and responsibility and commitment to, uh, in this case to, to the Constitution and to the laws of the United States. So I think that point has to be emphasized, so I, I will emphasize that. Um, Ms., uh, I'm going to follow up, Ms. Hinderstein, uh, with a question that uh, and give you a little more time to elaborate, uh, which is the securing of nuclear materials. Uh, again, I have the same concerns as my colleagues with respect to the, uh, the, the real danger of these materials falling into the hands of uh, terrorist groups, which are very difficult, if not impossible, to, to deter. And uh, what can you add to your previous answer? Thank you, Senator. Um, I really uh, am appreciative of this line of inquiry because I do think that nuclear security and anything that we can do to reduce the risk that terrorists could acquire nuclear radiological material is extremely important and it's a risk that uh, threatens to kind of fall below the radar while we deal with other extremely important national security issues. Um, if confirmed, I would seek to support uh, a number of the of the uh, really important programs that the Office of Defense Nuclear Nonproliferation has not only innovated but implemented uh, with partners around the world, um, because it's not just about telling folks what to do; it's more about giving them the tools, the capability, and the sustainability to uh, continue that mission uh, globally. Because the United States, we can't just protect ourselves here; we have to uh, protect ourselves um, in any area of risk. Well, thank you very much. I'm informed that Senator Rosen is uh, available. At